in Hyde Park by Henry Kendall. They come from the highways of labor, from labor and leisure we come, but not to the sound of a taper, not to the beating of drum. The thousands of people assemble, the faces of shadow and flame, and spirits that sicken and tremble because of a sorrow and shame. The voice is the voice of a nation, but lo, it is muffled and mute, for a sword of a strong tribulation hath stricken the peace to the root. The beautiful tokens of pity have utterly fled from the eyes, for the demon who darkened the city is cursed in the breaking of sighs. Their thoughts are as one, and together they band in the terrible ira, like a legions of wind and fierce weather, whose footsteps are thunder and fire. But forever, like springs of sweet water, which sings from the grass hidden lease, as soft as the voice of a daughter, where comes the whisper from wees. There cometh from shame and dejection, from wrath and from blackness wealth, a word at whose heart is affection, with a sighing whose meaning is love. In the land of distress and of danger, with the forts and sack of and dust, we reap for the wounds of a stranger and mourn over the ashes of trust. We reap for the prince and the mother whose years have been smitten of grief, of a son and the lord and the brother and the widow, the queen and the chief. But he, having moved like splendor amongst women heavier days, with a grace that is manly and tender and the kindness that passes our praise, will think in the sickness and shadow of greetings and forest and groove, and welcome and sit in meadow, nor couple the sin with a laugh. For the sake of a touching devotion which sobs through the depths of her woe, this son of the kings of the ocean, as he come to them, trusting will go.